Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, I just wanted to quickly uh, let you guys know that if you are getting started with machine learning and uh, you're having trouble uh, setting up your local environment, there are other options within Azure that you can utilize. And one of the things that you can do, you can go to your Azure and you can deploy a data science virtual machine. So the, there are two different kind, there are multiple kinds available, but if you want to go with the Linux version, the data science virtual machine Ubuntu based on Ubuntu 18.04 is available. And what's the great thing about it? You have all the tools that you need that are already pre-installed and configured. So you don't waste any time, you know, getting started with your machine learning journey. Okay, so if you prefer a Windows version, so you can go to the Windows virtual machine and again, you have everything installed, in, including Anaconda, Python, SQL Server 2019 edition with, uh, with in database R and Python analytics. You have Office 365 Pro Plus BYOL, Shared Computer Activation, Julia, Jupyter Notebooks, Visual Studio Community Edition, Python R, Node.js Tools, Power BI Desktop, Deep Learning Tools like TensorFlow and Chainer, Email Algorithms based on XGBoost, uh, and Azure SDK where you have all of the tools that are integrated, okay, Data Lake, Blob Storage, Hadoop, SQL Data Warehouse, Stream Analytics, Data Factory, everything is in there. So in this one, uh, this uh, the, the the Ubuntu one is similar. So I'm just in this particular uh, video. I'm just gonna create a data learning data science virtual machine based on Ubuntu, and I'm just gonna create a data science is what I'm gonna say. Okay, for this virtual machine. Okay, data science Ubuntu data science ds ubuntu is what i'm going to call it and um, it's already selected that image and uh, everything else ssh key if you you can use i'm just going to go with password for now and uh, password that i'm going to use very secure okay let's see Okay, my passwords match so everything else I'm just gonna go with the default options here okay and uh, it will just go through the review process and make sure that everything looks good and when the validation is successful I'm just gonna create this particular virtual machine and that should should be done pretty quickly so let's see and just wait for a couple seconds Again, you can watch your uh, deployment that is in that that's ongoing over here, and it it will say that deployment is in progress. And here, as different things are getting deployed, like the IP address, the virtual network, the network security group, everything that uh, as you need uh, to be able to deploy this particular data science virtual machine uh, that's ongoing. And these days it shouldn't take more than like a couple minutes to deploy your virtual machine, although it's gonna install a whole bunch of things, so that might take a little bit. So while this is going on, let's uh, go back over here one more time, click on one uh, resource, and uh, let's see what else uh, is available for data science virtual machine. So this one we already looked at, uh, look like there is some other Iguazio data science platform MP. I have not used that one. There is one Intel optimized data science VM for Linux. There's another offering. Uh, there are few others. This one, Python, my kind of Python box. I don't know if that's related, but at least four of them uh, absolutely that you have available that you can use. I think the deployment is completed. Deployment successful. Just click on go to resource. Uh, now, this is your resource where uh, you have everything running. Uh, it's not using a lot of resource. We have not used a very powerful machine, but it should be enough to get started. Um, and to connect to this particular machine, uh, you can just clip. Let's see if my terminal supports uh, 
uh, SSH at the moment. It's a new M1 Mac. So let's see. If not, you know how to connect to our. Um, how to create a new one, a Domino, and then a new window. And here, let's for see if this. Yeah, it looks like SSH is there. So student at you provide the IP address and uh, hit enter and say yes and then you provide the password and you should be inside your virtual machine now so love yeah here we go so we are inside the virtual machine so this virtual machine where I am uh, this one has everything that I need to uh, that uh, uh, that I can use for the machine learning and it can like when I first log in you see that you have a little bit of a, a, a description of this particular VM and it's saying this data science VM includes this conda environment all of them a Python as your ML as your ML activate any environment at a terminal with conda activate and then you need to run this command to uh, be able to uh, run this thing and uh, everything is available as a Jupyter kernel okay so there we go have fun and you can do the same thing with uh, Windows as well and the deployment should be should be very very similar so if I go back in here one more time uh, do um, data science and here is my Windows machine. You do the same thing with create. I can put it in the same resource group. Uh, I had the wrong resource. I mean, it's misspelled, but it's okay. So virtual machine DS Windows. I can say that. And again, uh, you have everything. You provide your username and again a secure password. Okay, when the password matches, uh, you just go, go to disk and everything. I'm not changing anything in here. And uh, we'll deploy this one as well uh, because the deployment didn't really take that long. So uh, this one will be deployed just as, uh, as quickly as the other virtual machine. And you will have uh, uh, this machine uh, available too as well. So again if you are uh, getting started with uh, machine learning and you did, don't want to spend a lot of time configuring your environment because trust me uh, sometimes the setting up of the environment it will take you a long time and you will have to do a lot of research on how to exactly configure things so that everything works nicely and uh, beautifully so it's a really big help if you start with one of these uh, data science virtual machines that is already pre-configured everything is installed for you and uh, you know it will just help you to quickly get started with your main job that is learning the machine learning maybe doing some ai all right that's all i wanted to let you guys know that this option is available and uh, go ahead and use this uh, for your for your learning machine learning well, thanks, thanks for watching the video. I appreciate it. If you like it, please give me the, a like, bu like uh, uh, button. Click on it and please subscribe. And um, have a wonderful learning experience with uh, machine learning and AI. Thank you.